Gotham Noir is officially on Indiegogo. Gotham Noir is officially on Indiegogo. Unfortunately, we were not able to meet our goal on Kickstarter before the deadline. And when everything was sort of ready, everything was coming out, the teaser and all that was unfortunately right at the end of the Kickstarter campaign, which meant like the juicier stuff came later, which wasn't the original plan, but things happen in filmmaking. That's all right. Not gonna let it discourage us. Our whole team and everyone have been so supportive when we announced that the Kickstarter was unsuccessful. And now that we've announced that Indiegogo is now the new path for Gotham Noir, everyone's been so supportive and I just want to say a massive thank you to everyone who's watching this video who has watched any of the Gotham Noir videos this can't be done without you all of your support or the comments and well wishes and everything it means the world to us it means the world to me as a Batman fan as a director it honestly is a dream come true to be able to do this and to be directing writing producing a Batman movie it really is a dream come true for me as like kid who grew up with Batman and loved all the Batman movies and the TV shows and the comics and everything and honestly a big thank you to you for all your support the Indiegogo link is right down in the description and it will also be the first pinned comment so head on over to Indiegogo to check out all the details everything's pretty much the same as the Kickstarter if you did see that one except now we've added in the new official poster which Speaking of which, this is our new poster for Gotham Noir. So we've updated the Indiegogo with all the new material we've released. So you can find any details about the Indiegogo on that link in the first pinned comment. Now for just some Gotham Noir updates, we did release our first teaser trailer last week and the reception has been outstanding. We can't thank you enough for that. It feels so cool to be able to finally say that the pig is the villain of Gotham Noir. Now quick rundown, Gotham Noir is a Batman fan film, feature length fan film with a horror twist. It's set in the early 1900s, so that means Batman has no Kevlar, no carbon fiber, has no high-tech anything really. So Batman, Catwoman, and Gordon have to investigate a string of murders happening down in the Narrows, which is Gotham's lowest income area. And together they race against the clock because also our film takes place during Christmas. So a big inspiration for the film, if you couldn't already tell, is the Batman the Animated Series for the dark deco aesthetics and the overall beautiful writing of what I consider to be one of the definitive versions of Batman, Kevin Conroy, may he rest in peace. And also another big inspiration is the Batman Returns film of Tim Burton with Michael Keaton. That whole Sleepy Hollows vibe, that sort of aesthetic, it also takes place during Christmas. So Batman Returns is a very spiritual cousin to this film as well. The storyline is obviously unrelated to it, but just the overall aesthetics, the vibe of that one, we sort of carry that through and enhance it more in a horror realm in our film. So yeah, we have the teaser trailer, we have the first couple posters, we have the first look at the pig. I'm not sure if we've put this up properly but you can see it in the indiegogo campaign and i will show you here here is your first proper look at the pig we put together the costume based on the comics and the arkham knight game that side mission where you do investigate professor pig and you follow the opera all that by the way i'm giving you a clue for the film so costume was sort of put together and then chris stanley did his amazing talents of weathering it painting it making it look bloody disgusting horrific they really lent to us selling the emotions and the expectations sort of with this film in the teaser trailer because because you see, you see the pig dressed up and the tone of the entire teaser is very much as people have said, sort of Saw vibes, kind of like the Saw movies, that kind of horror, which yes, is kind of accurate, not entirely to the gore level of Saw, but we are going for a similar type. Maybe mix Saw with a bit more psychological horror, maybe mix those two. That's kind of like the tone of, of the film. You can follow all the updates on Gotham Noir Movie on Instagram. That's where we put everything up first, then it gets spread to TikTok, YouTube Shorts, here on YouTube. If you want to stay up to date, you want to be a first to know when things drop, Gotham Noir Instagram, it is listed down below. Thank you once again for all your support. We are now on Indiegogo. Share it around, share around this video, the teaser trailer, posters, anything. All your help is appreciated. Every little bit counts and we'll see you soon. Why do we fall, sir? So that we can learn to pick ourselves up.